Assalamu alaikum everybody. Today we have a question how to draw a 3D contour for any uh, physical quantity by using Tecalot. Uh, we want to show our results, numerical results, in 3D, three dimensions, and instead of two dimension, will be give uh, um, a full picture for the uh, distribution of the any quantity, stress, strain, uh, deflection, uh, maybe temperature, velocity, pressure, any uh, physical quantity um, uh, by uh, using tick blood. Now uh, we have to use any simulator, for example, fluent, uh, Abacus, uh, maybe a solid work. Uh, for example, I use uh, Fluent uh, and simulated uh, already uh, this physical domain uh, like heat sink. This is the solid base of heat sink for one channel. And now we have this uh, fin and uh, both sides uh, are uh, fluid. Uh, by uh, using Fluent and I simulated this uh, model, uh, then we have also the uh, results. So we want to show the uh, uh, distribution for, for example, uh, temperature, uh, this pressure, temperature for the interior of the base only, only the base. So we can show that by using uh, the interior of the base. I'll not enter this one. Display. So we can see the distribution of temperature but maybe uh, this figure uh, lower resolution cannot be used in thesis or paper like this for example so how can I uh, show uh, this, this uh, the distribution of temperature or any quantity with a resolution and I can change the setting of the figure as I want right first I have to export this quantity uh, depends on the version. Uh, I use uh, version 14 uh, for the fluent. Uh, then I go from file to export and then solution data. Okay. And then I select take a lot. Last one. Uh, the domain, the part of the domain, I want the interior of the base. I think this one, interior base, part base. And the temperature maybe velocity but not in solid should be in uh, fluent domain static temperature right uh, for example here okay contours right for example here any name contours done then i have to go to the tablet right i uh, use tablet uh, 360 and you you can use also version 9 9 can but 8 cannot version 8 cannot uh, by going to file to import the data which i exported already uh, and then go to load data file uh, then go to the file this one open it will be displayed in 2d i have to change to 3d right as we see, this is 2D. I can change from this uh, option plot from 2D to 3D Cartesian. This um, 3D, but you can see it's black and white. Uh, then I can use can to change it to color, uh, antique uh, shade, and also uh, antique lighting. Then uh, you can see the uh, X, Y, Z uh, axis is rotated. Uh, this is the position of Y, uh, Y axis. So I can change and rotate the figure as I want from view to rotate. Uh, for example, X axis, I will rotate the uh, axis from X axis around X axis. I think it's okay now, right? Also, I can uh, rotate uh, around Y axis, for example, like this, uh, around the Z axis. Okay, as you need. Now, also, I can change the setting of the legend. Uh, for example, I want to remove the box, the number format. Uh, if you have uh, here uh, digits, 
you can remove from uh, using integer right or using uh, maybe uh, digits so maybe float and the number of position how number you need for example two three four up to you uh, so you can see right it's not uh, suitable you can change it to uh, integer to be uh, uh, only integer right the levels i think um, after knowing that the minimum value and maximum value of temperature here as uh, uh, displayed here i can change the maximum and minimum level and the number of uh, uh, distribution how many levels all right so uh, here is uh, 310 while the minimum is 308 uh, maximum is 347 by neglecting the uh, uh, i mean the, the decimals all right and the number of levels is for 15 only okay so now uh, also i can change the color to be a blue for example and then the font style like this size is up to you position you can also dynamically change the position of legend uh, also the position of uh, xyz and the color right this is a uh, extra uh, setting then uh, after uh, doing this one you can also add uh, for example uh, a level here uh, approximately not uh, precisely so i can uh, use this option just click here and click here for example you can add many levels as you uh, like uh, or you can remove levels from here or here here you can see or you can do that uh, precisely by double click on the legend and go to levels add here single level for example here we have 344 and uh, 347 okay i want to put a level here between them okay for example 345 you can see here i added this one this level 345 right so uh, you can also just look here where's the uh, great gap i think between 12 and 13 so i will add uh, for example zero for zero you can see i added here right so this uh, this addition is uh, precisely or dynamically by using this these options add or remove okay uh, also here you can rotate uh, dynamically the figure uh, and then uh, at the end you can export this figure uh, by using many many options as you need uh, depending on the resolution you you need right so for example i will use jpeg okay uh, this will be uh, exported uh, i mean normally like this desktop contours save right i will go to the picture you can see maybe this uh, mm, uh, this kind of with low resolution so you can change the setting to, to get a high resolution more than, than this one uh, and use it in your thesis or paper i hope uh, this video is useful for you any question comment you can write down after this video to uh, just uh, comment on this video uh, for uh, any notice you 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 see right thank you so much